Hey y'all, it's that girl Lele. I am so excited for tonight. Keep your eyes on VMA's Twitter tonight for VMA Stand Cam, where you get to vote on what you see behind the scenes. Some of tonight's biggest stars are gonna be popping up to do your bidding, so make your vote count. There's even a poll about me that you've been voting on. We'll check in soon to see what's winning. I can't wait to see what you pick. But right now, get hyped and get ready, cause the 2021 VMA pre-show is about to begin. Keep it locked here on Twitter to catch all the action on the red carpet, and I'll be back soon to kick off our first Stan Cam poll results. Toodles and pink poodles. This is my first award show, and okay. I got to spend it at the VMAs. I feel amazing. Hi, mommy. I love you. Give God the glory, Lizzo. Hallelujah. Three and one time for him, Lizzo. <laughs>
live on planet Earth is Doja Cat. Enjoy. Who the f is Doja Cat? She made her first big music video in her own bedroom, writing, making beats, and shooting in front of sheep she pinned to the wall. Since Moo dropped, she has become a force, and she's about to crush it with her first VMA performance. A three-time nominee tonight, Doja Cat. And the VMA goes to Doja Cat. No, no, no you really oh, won. You're the best Oh my god, I thought I didn't care about this. Wow. Oh, put the mic up. Oh yeah. <laughs> wow. I know it's been a really hard year and uh, I I just want everybody to stay safe. Take care of yourselves. I think that I probably missed one of the biggest thank yous so far. F I'm rambling now. I just want to say thank you to my fans. It, me on social media is one thing, because I will joke and I will meme all day, but when I stand here right now and tell you that I'm so thankful to have you as supporters, the fact that this happened and you are a huge part of that means everything to me and I'm not gonna cry, but um, I love you and thank you and uh, That's right, that's right. Welcome to the 2021 MTV Video Music Awards pre-show. We're here in Brooklyn, New York on the red carpet at the Barclays Center gearing up for an incredible show. As you can see, the energy out here is crazy tonight. As always, tonight's show will be jam-packed with the hottest artists that have dominated your speakers and your screens all year, like Olivia Rodrigo, Lil Nas X, Normani, and Justin Bieber, and that's just to name a few. I'm Nessa, one of your hosts tonight, and I'll be joined by my all-female hosting team. We will be running this red carpet, okay? Say hi to my co-host, Jamila. <laughs> and recording artist, pop star, and tonight's celebrity correspondent, Tanache. That's right. This is going to be a ton of fun. And until the main show starts, we're here on the carpet counting down with exclusive performances, interviews, and awards. This is the best party of the year, so let's not waste any more time getting into it. Oh, by the way, I saw Doja Cat. All right, let's see what's going on with Jamila. Who do you have over there? Thank you so much, Nessa. Now, this carpet is gonna be red hot tonight, and heating things up right now is an incredible artist who's performing. And not only that, he's nominated for one, two, three, four, five, six nominations for VMAs. It's Little Nas X. Yeah, Little Nas. Good for me. Let's jump right into it. We already talked about the accolades. How does it feel being back on the red carpet for the VMAs. Wow, I'm nervous as shit. Um, everything feels good. It feels good though, you know, I'm happy. I'm happy, I look good, I look, look, look good. Listen, I'm not gonna say I'm hating on the fit, but let's move on, okay? okay? Now, in 2019, when you accepted your award, you rolled out a scroll, okay? If you do win tonight, do you have another scroll and where are you hiding it at? I don't know what I'm gonna do when I win tonight, honestly, but you know, it's gonna be something great. Yeah. Listen, I, I see how you threw in when I went, okay? That's how you claim it, okay? Manifestation. Manifestation. Now, you performed uh, Panini on the main stage as well uh -huh. back in 2019. I mean, it was it was iconic. Do you plan on topping that? Like, do you try to outdo your performances or? Absolutely. This is going to be one to remember. It's going to be a really okay. great performance. How you topping it? Tell me in this ear. I can't look. <laughs> I got you. Now listen, also, okay, you know, your debut album. Oh. Your debut, say it in the mic. Montero, my debut album, Montero, Comes September out September 17th. 17th. You, he, Friday. He taking all my lines, September I'm 17th. I'm sorry, it's, it's, I, it's but gonna it is be a world question, stopper. You ready a for world, it? A world stopper. You this ready? is my question for you. What direction are you taking Montero in? What can your fans expect? Because it's the hard. The future. Mm. The future. Some of the future, the future in one word. What does that look like for you? The future looks like Montero, the album. September 17th. <laughs> Listen.
listen, thank you so much for chatting with me, Little Nas X. Listen, I know that you are going to have an amazing show tonight. You have so much in store. Go ahead. Let, let, let me see that cake walk off. Let me, oh, I love it. I love it. Okay, enough of him. Put the carpet on me. I have to see it. what else is going on on the red carpet. What's up, everyone? I'm coming to you straight from the fan pit. There isn't a better place to be if you love music, and we, myself included, are so excited about what's going to happen tonight. Like introducing our first pre-show performer. Are you guys ready? <laughs> this Chicago-born rapper dropped his third studio album, Hall of Fame, this summer, and it immediately became a number one. Please give it up for, say it with me, you guys, one, two, three, Polo G! Uh, cop the BMW, new deposit, I picked up another bag, like, I'm a count while I'm in it. I hear planes flying, crowd screaming, money counters change. I guess that's how it sound when you, I ain't joking, do it sound like I'm kidding. I've been making like 2,000 a minute, so high up through the clouds I was swimming. I'm probably gonna drown when I'm in it, I bet she gonna get loud when I'm and we might have a, I won't love her after we, she can't get near me. Only I give a conversation to a series. My pants are merry, yes, I want it clearly. I'm the chosen one, see my potential, so they fear me. God, I wonder, can you hear me? Thinking about the old me, I swear I miss you dearly. Stay down till you come, I'm, I've been sticking to that theory. Every day of battle, I'm exhausted and I'm weary. Make sure I smile in public when alone, my eyes teary. I fall through it all, but they hurt me severely. I've been getting how to have behind my insecurity. Taking different pills, but I know it ain't no cop to BMW. New deposit, I picked up another bag, like, and I'm a cow while I'm in it. I hear planes flying, crowds scrimming, money counters change. Uh, How that sound when you say? I ain't joking, do it sound like I'm kidding. I've been making like 2,000 a minute. So high up through the clouds, I was swimming. I'm probably going to drown when I'm in it. I bet she going to get loud when I'm... They say I'm Pac Rebirth, never put out a weak verse. I'm a size one wheeler, I'm a step to my feet hurt. When putting them streets first, white tees turn burgundy t shirts. Looking for some real, he's stuck in a deep surf. Anxiety killing me, I just wanna leave her. When they ask if I'm okay, they just make everything seem worse. Trying to explain your feelings, sound like some you rehearse. Stab me on my back with a clean Looking so deep into your eyes, I can read your thoughts, sir. Shut the, I mean, please don't tell. I done been through too much and I don't need enough. Put that on every war, scoff every. Cop the BMW, new deposit, I picked up another bag. Like, yeah, and I'm a cow while I'm in it. I hear planes flying, crowds screaming, money counters change. I guess that's how I sound, what you say? I ain't joking, do it sound like I'm kidding. I've been making like 2,000 a minute. So high up through the clouds, I was swimming. I'm probably gonna drown when I'm in it. I bet she gonna get loud when I'm, and we might have a child when I'm finished. When I'm finished, when I'm finished. Be amazed, thanks for having me. Listen, now that's how you kick off a pre-show. I mean, do I even have to introduce this incredible artist that I'm right here next to? They've been chanting your name all day. Doja Cat. Listen, you are here, congratulations. Now, I wanna go back a little bit with you, Doja. Last year was your first VMAs. This year, you're running the show. I feel, I feel like you gave me a job this year. Thank you. I still haven't processed it yet. This is amazing. This yes. is amazing. Now, this is from my understanding, first time in history, a host is going to be performing as well as nominated. You have different hats. How are you balancing all of this? Um, with hats. <laughs> I have a lot of funky hats tonight. Do you? No, you literally gave me the perfect opener for that, like just now. I'm wearing really crazy hats. I don't really want to spoil it. Spoil. But I got some really, nope, uh-uh. <laughs> I'll say I, I am wearing furniture somewhere. Furniture. That's how I spoiled it. That's a spoiler. We love the visuals. You have a yeah. beautiful Thank vision. You. What else can you tell us about your performance tonight? Just a um, little something. So I already spoiled that I'm doing Been Like This and You Right. Yes! And 
it's going to be very different in the sense that it's not upbeat and crazy. It's more emotional Ooh. and intense. Oh, yes. Yes. I like this energy. Lots of emotions. So tell me, how did you prepare to become a host tonight? Did you tap into anyone and ask for hosting tips? I mean, we last second this entire thing, and I, I feel <laughs> like that's fine with me because I usually like to improvise, and I think everyone trusted me, so I think it's going to be good. Uh, no preparation. But yeah. Oh, oh, I like that. No preparation. How about any rituals before you get out here? Any rituals? I, I quit my rituals. I <laughs> used to have a little bit of a little shot, a little something. A little something. <laughs> I, th I think I quit just because it's too much now. But it's all right. Listen, I can't yeah. wait to see you in there. So great to see you again. Congratulations on all the success. Thank all you. All your fans were chanting your name. Doja Cat, can't wait to see you kill it. Yeah. Thank you. Yes, absolutely. Thank you. Give it up for Doja Cat. Now, we know songs don't just blow up if you aren't playing, sharing, and listening to them. So we asked you why you love the nominees for Song of the Year. Here's what you had to say. Song of the Year. 24K Golden featuring Ian Dior, Mood. I think the song Mood should win Song of the Year at the VMAs. This year, it is totally addictive. Your grandparents know it, your parents know it, your cousin knows it, your neighbors know it. Mood was the song of the summer. Bruno Mars, Anderson Pac, Silk Sonic, Leave the Door Open. Leave the Door Open by Bruno Mars should win Song of the Year. It's amazing, gets me hyped. I mean, think about it, man. It went all the way back to the 70s era. It had me feeling like I was listening to The Temptations. Give it up for Bruno Mars! BTS. Dynamite. This song broke so many records. It always has stayed at the top of the charts and always everyone has been playing it, constantly playing it, and I know I have. Go, go, go for the song of the year. Go, Dynamite! Cardi B featuring Megan Thee Stallion. Wow. Song of the year, Cardi and Megan. Wow. I love the choreography. I love the looks. I love the colors. It was very entertaining to watch. Wop for song of the year. Woo! Olivia Rodrigo, driver's license. Ever since she put out this masterpiece of an album, she has just blown me away. No one has done it like she has in the span of eight months. I mean, who remembers life before driver's license? Mm -hmm. Dua Lipa, levitating. I'm leaving for Dua Lipa because I hope her song Levitating wins song of the year. Everyone, let's hear it up. Everyone loves that song, Levitating! Listen, okay, this is an insanely good group of nominees. Our pre-show coverage has just begun. Stay tuned because coming up, we have performances from Kim Petras and Swedish House Mafia, plus even more exclusive red carpet arrivals, awards, A-list interviews, more of Jamela, and guess what? This year's most amazing talent on the planet. All that and more right after the break, so why would you guys turn that dial? Keep it locked, we got more coming up. Baby, where did these be at when they said they're doing all this and all that? Security, dude. All right, once again, a red carpet recap. 
Out of the carpet currently, Anita, Seth Cameron, Sean Mendez, Jack Harlow, Moneybag, Casey Musgrave. Coming up, Young Dylan, David Lee Roth, and the Kid Leroy. Now you could go to any old red carpet and find looks, but you come to the VMA red carpet for the looks, period. Let's check out some of the most iconic fashion from the last three decades of the VMAs. It wouldn't be the VMAs without the jaw-dropping, sometimes shocking, and always unforgettable fashion on the carpet. Do you remember your favorite VMA fashion moment? Here are some of ours. And the VMA for Video of the Year goes to Lady Gaga. I never thought I'd be asking Cher to hold my meat purse. I thought the mayor of New York had outlawed outfits like this. This is amazing. <laughs> well, tonight I just thought that I'd do something that just say, look at her. <laughs> Wow, that's Katy Perry, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, how you doing? Good to see you. What are you wearing right now? We're wearing Versace, custom Versace, of course. Okay. This is a Vera Wang ensemble, and my publicist was a little nervous, so I am, I am wearing things under this garment. What you wearing? Describe this. What is this? What, I'm, what inspired it? Uh, Jean Paul Gaultier. Give it up for Lady Gaga, you guys. the 2021 VMA red carpet. Now, as you already know, the VMAs is like a night like none other for all of our nominees. But one of my favorite moments of the night is watching a new artist get their shine on right here on the VMA stage, okay? Now, MTV always acknowledges some of the most talented newcomers for the award for best new artist presented by Facebook. And this year is no different. Now the fandoms came together and voted which VMA rookie they think should take home the award this year. And we have narrowed it down to just two top contenders. Now you guys at home can vote on Twitter using these hashtags right there. And the winner will be announced later on during the main show. So make sure you keep it locked right here to see who takes home the moon person for best new artist. Now let's see what else is going down on the red carpet. So much is happening out here and I'm extremely excited because look who decided to show up to the VMAs, Kid Leroy. Hi. Hey, what's up? Listen, you see all the superstars walking right by. I'm happy that you're here. Three nominations tonight, including Best Artist. How does this feel for you? Dude, this is my first award show, so I'm super, it's a lot, you know what I'm it's saying? A lot? It's a lot. i um, very confused as to what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> but they told me that this is a great thing to do, so yes. what's up? No, I'm so happy that you're here. So how did you prepare for tonight? What were we going to see? Uh, well, I rehearsed a couple times. Okay. Um, I'm performing my song today with Justin. Nice. And, um, Wait, let's put some, you know, let, let's make sure we <laughs> say that right. Justin Bieber, Justin you Bieber. know, that's yeah. going to be great. So did you guys talk and discuss what it's going to be like? Can you tell us in the inside scoop? Yeah, so we've, um, we've done the song like quite a few times. Uh, like just various places and then he just brought me the set build and was like yo let's do mountains and I was like 
sick. And uh, yeah, so you're going to see mountains. This is right. exciting. Is there yeah. anyone in particular that you're looking forward to seeing at all? Um, I'm excited to see Olivia. Yeah? As my friend. Yeah. Oh. I'm going to say what's up to her. I love um, that. I, I'm uh, Jack. I'm yeah, say of course. Jack. Um, it's, yeah, lots of people. Well, yeah. I'm so excited for you. How are we doing so far? Are you having fun? I am. I'm having lots of fun. I see my friend Omo over there. So. Where, where, where? Oh, yes! The red hair. Yeah, there he goes. We saw Lil Nas X earlier. Look at this. So yeah, much love. Let's go. See, I like this. You liking it? Yeah, I'm liking it now because my <laughs> friends are here. Yes. Well, a little I'm, weird before. No, 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 no. I'm your friend. I'm not you're your friend. You're my friend. Yeah, you're my okay, friend. Okay, good. You're okay, good. Friend. Well, listen, I know you're going to go join your friends right now. Thank you so yeah. much. Can't wait to see you out there. Of course. Thank Have you for having me. Have an amazing me. night. Absolutely. For sure. Now let's see what else is happening on the red carpet. Ladies. I'm here with pop heartthrob Sean Mendez, who is a nominee and a performer tonight. What's up, Sean? How, How are you, you doing? doing? You look amazing. This Thank is you so, so much. Yeah. You're no stranger to the VMA stage, and you're performing again tonight. Any surprises in store for us? No surprises. I'm just really happy to be here and see people in person. It's been a long year. How are you feeling to see people again and feel that energy? Oh, my. I mean, nervous. Like, I don't even know what to do with all the energy, actually. And I feel like this is just like... It's weird. It feels like the first VMAs again, so it's nice. Absolutely. And you have a new project that you're performing tonight. How does that feel, performing your new project for your fans? It feels so good. It feels really, really good. I'm, I'm really excited to see my girlfriend play, actually. I think she's going to... I think her performance is going to be spectacular. Oh, spicy. Well, congratulations on your nomination for Wonder. What is it about Wonder that you think resonates with your fans? I think it's true. I think I took a lot of time to like really find something authentic inside of me and I feel like I really cared about it and it came out very honest, you know, and they always connect with my truth. Absolutely. Yeah. I think fans can tell the difference when yeah. it's authentic. Well, thank you so much, Sean. We're so excited to see you perform. Thank you. Thank you, thank you guys for saying hi. Enjoy the show and let's check out what else is happening. Now, I don't know, okay? No one told me this. But I just have a feeling that it's gonna be a huge night for this next artist. It's Olivia Rodrigo. What is going on? Wow. wow. Take that moment in. Take the moment in, okay? Now, Olivia, this is your very first MTV VMA. What is it like being here tonight? Oh my gosh, it's so exciting. The energy is incredible, and I'm just so stoked to be here. Really grateful. <sighs> I'm stoked for you to be here. Now, not only are you here attending and all those other great things, but you will be gracing the stage. What can you tell us about your performance tonight? Ooh, um, it's going to be super fun. There's going to be dancing and sparkles, yes. and there might even be a little flying, which is going to be really exciting. Okay, I have to wait and see. I won't even ask you any more questions, okay? <laughs> but you are nominated for so many awards tonight. And one of them, uh, one of those categories that you're nominated for is the Push Performance of the Year. Now, we all know that MTV Push, you know, they highlight emerging artists that are on the rise, those artists who are next up to become global icons, okay? Uh, how has your life changed? Because last year, you were actually named Push Artist of the Year. And what has your life been like since then? Oh my gosh. I mean, this year has been so incredible. Uh, I put out my first song this January, <laughs> and that's just been this crazy, magical roller coaster. And I also graduated high school, so it's just been an all around wow. great year. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> I, I don't want to be corny, but I'm a big, big supporter uh, of education, okay? Yeah. And it sounds like things are exciting for you. So things are about to get a little bit more exciting for you, okay? Now, I have to just say this uh, because you just won. Are you ready? Okay, I don't want to make it a big deal, <laughs> but you just won Push Performance of the Year, ah! Olivia. Thank you. Oh my gosh, it's, I know. it's so heavy. I literally have no upper body strength. Thank you. Listen, oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Listen, I was back there doing push-ups just so I can practice holding it for you. So I want you to do me a favor, Olivia, if you will. Look right there into the camera, okay? okay. You see your millions of fans. What would you like to say to them as you accept this award? Oh my gosh, um, huge thank you. Uh, I, I couldn't be more grateful. Um, all of this is because of you guys, so thanks a million. I appreciate it. Mwah. Congratulations again, and enjoy the rest of your night. Thank I'm so excited you. for you. You too. I
Ooh, fun. Go kill it. Okay, now I have to see what else is happening. Now listen, more from the 2021 VMA red carpet coming up, including the award for Push Performance of the Year. Nessa also catches up with pop rocker icon Avril Lavigne and so, so much more. Trust me, you do not want to miss it. But first, let's just take a look at uh, one of the night's biggest nominees. Let it go. Join me in welcoming BTS. After dropping their latest album last year, K-pop phenomenon BTS is still riding a wave of success across the entire globe. Hi, MTV and everyone watching out there. Hello, we are BTS. Their song Butter is nominated for six VMAs and still on the charts after its release last May. Smooth like butter, like a criminal under. Pretty smooth. The album's main concept is shedding a hopeful light during this new global climate and reminding listeners that our life goes on. And the winner <laughs> for Best K-Pop is BTS! Best K-Pop for two years running. Yeah. 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 We love you, Army, and we'll make sure to give back this love with even greater music and performances. <laughs> people will they take home tonight watch and find out MTV always has their eye on the next big thing, and every month they feature a new artist, bringing you a steady stream of the latest and greatest on the music scene via MTV Push. Let's learn a little more about this year's MTV Push artists, and then take a look at the supersonic glow up of another. Billie Eilish, Lizzo, SZA, some of tonight's biggest performers and nominees had their big debuts right here on MTV Push. And continuing in that tradition, 12 new breakout artists are now nominated for Push Performance of the Year. This is crazy. I'm just really excited to see what happens. Everyone watching this remember the name Madison Beer. Let's meet some of them, shall we? Why you holding on if you can't go back? When you say something that you dream about and you touch your dreams for the first time, it makes you start to dream bigger. It makes you realize how much more you can do and how limited you were looking at the world. All of this, all the lights, all the cameras, all these interviews, performances, that all came from a dream and a, a, a belief that I had in myself. So I, I've been saying before anyone else said it, I'm going to be the biggest artist in the world. Now it's just time for the world to catch up. You guys should give me a VMA because I have a video of myself when I'm like three years old and I'm singing the Star Spangled Banner and then at the end of it, I'm like, thank you MTV. And 
and I blow a kiss at the camera, and that would be a really cute Instagram post thanking you guys if I got a VMA. I feel like whatever happens is gonna happen, and all I know is that uh, I'm working my hardest to do it. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, it's not meant to be, you know, so. Who will take home the moon person for best push performance of the year? Keep it locked to find out. The Doja Cat is out of the bag. Meet the hosts of the 2021 VMAs. After winning last year's Push Award, Doja Cat is nominated for six VMAs tonight, including Artist and Video of the Year. Performing live on Planet Her is Doja Cat. Enjoy. Show. I'm your girl Jamela Mustafa and I am coming to you live from the Barclays Center right here in Brooklyn, New York. Now I'm here on the red carpet right now with singer, songwriter, and VMA first timer, Little Huddy. Yes, ma'am. What's going on, <laughs> Little Huddy? Not too much, man. This is my first time here. I'm really excited. Oh my goodness. Now when you say excited, right? Because that's just I'm excited. What does that really mean to you? I mean, these are so many artists I've looked up to for three, four, five years, and being able to be here for the first time and experience their lives is just amazing. Oh my goodness. And you look fabulous. Thank you. You know, I have to say a lot of artists that are performing tonight, they have a stage name, but that's not their birth name. And I don't know, okay? I'm not your sister. But I'm guessing that your parents didn't put Lil Huddy on the birth certificate. No, ma'am, no, they didn't. <laughs> okay, so listen, I, I want to have some fun. Is, is, it, is it okay if I, if I get some fans and we try to guess who the real Lil Huddy is? Yeah, I'm, I'm okay with that, yeah. <laughs> okay, Let's he's do it. game. Let's do it. Okay, here we go, okay? So I have you guys, I've enlisted some fans, and they're going to see if they can reveal this. Now, this cue card right here, that's all scrambled up. It actually says your real name. And whoever can unscramble it in 10 seconds oh, yeah. wins. Okay, now what you win is you are crowned royalty right here on the red carpet. It doesn't get better than that. No, it doesn't. Are you ready to do it? <laughs> I'm let's, ready. Let's go. All right. All right. All right. Um, uh, C. Starts with it. His last name five, starts with the H. Four, okay. um, three, Jason two. two. Oh! oh! That's yeah, the one. It is, it is. There you go. Wow. Good that job. That is correct. Come on. That's correct. Uh, <laughs> the name is Chase Hudson, hey, a.k.a. No. Lil Hudson. Nice to meet you. Um, and, and I just absolutely love it. So many exciting things from you this year. And I know that you actually recently teamed up with Burger King yeah. as a part of their Keep It Real Meals campaign. I did. Also, Lil Huddy has some new music on the way. Oh, yeah, so I'm doing a challenge with uh, Burger King on TikTok. I've also been working with them for a while, a while now. I, uh, I went with me and my friends, and we all tried every single item on the menu, made sure we had the perfect, the perfect menu uh, like option for, for me. We narrowed it down. We had a whiteboard and everything. And, uh, yeah, I've been working on this album for about a year and a half, and it's been a, a real process. It's been a, a challenge for me. I mean... I've never done something like this before, and I'm really excited for the world to hear it, man. Well, you're not the only one. I'm really excited for this project to come out. Thank you for your time. Congratulations tonight. Thank you and so much. And I know that you're just going to kill it, okay? <laughs> you guys, let's go check in to see what my other co-hosts are doing. I know they're not having as much fun as us. about this person oh, yeah. joining me on the red carpet? Jack Harlow, how are you? Tanache, how are you? I'm amazing. Happy good to be to here. You. Good to see you. You look good in the leather. You look good. I got the leather on as well. Yeah, I love your hair. Thank you. You're returning to the VMAs this year after a stellar pre-show performance last year. How does it feel to be back tonight? It's good. I was, you know, a little worried last year. I didn't want all my success to take place on the internet. Now we're here in real life. It's a good feeling. Absolutely. We hear you and Lil Nas X have something pretty huge planned for tonight's performance. What can you tell us about it? You know him. He's a moment maker. Um, I'm just happy to be with him. He's a hell of a guy. He's over there looking incredible. Yeah, um, I see him over there. Stunning. Yeah, I'm excited. Just, the people are in for something. Okay, great. Are there going to be ele any elements from the music video in your performance tonight? 
Little sprinkles. Okay, okay. Keeping, keeping it a secret. We love that. What would middle school Jack have to say about you being here at the VMAs tonight? He'd be like, finally. Finally. I told you. Exactly. He knew what it was. It's happy to be here. Happy to be here. Very. Well, thank you so much for chatting with me. Enjoy your night. Thanks Hopefully for you don't me. sweat too much in this leather. I'm glad it was you. People don't know this is the first time we really met. It is the first time we've yeah. met. Well, we're thank excited you. to be here at the VMAs. And I'm standing here with another star, Osuna. So great to see you again. Yeah, yeah, second time to see you. Yes, welcome back to the VMAs. <laughs> How are you feeling right thank now? Thank you, thank you. I'm so happy, so, so, so happy. I got some special tonight. Tell me, you can't just go in there without saying something. Come on, Come we're on. friends. It's secret, but I got some special to my people. It's my premier of my next single, La Fonca, from my, the next album is Osutoshi. This is going to be amazing. <laughs> well, can you tell us what's going to happen on stage? That's, a little. I take every, every, every stage to La Fonca, and thanks for BMA to take time for me, thank this moment, and give me a moment to me to premiere, to do some special and something new. Yeah. Well, who are you hoping to run into tonight? Anyone Ooh, special? So special. I'm dancing. I got some playable good vibe to my people, to Latin people and American people see me in BMA. That's going to be amazing. Did you see anyone on the red carpet that you were happy to I see yet? I see a little Nas. I see Party Hilton. Everybody look beautiful. I know, right? Isn't this a moment? <laughs> yes. What makes the VMAs different than any other award show? He give the opportunity to the talents and present yes. new single, new something, and get like good vibe, got yes. the family vibe, everybody got take photo, and you know, got the pandemic the last time. Yes. So come this year to open and, you know, see your people is, is, is best, it's beautiful. Isn't it nice to see all the humans around yes, here? Yes, I'm taking my photo. I know, did you see us? We took so many pictures right now. Your yes. fans love you. I know. Are you checking your DMs after this? I'm checking every, every social media. Everybody say, yo, I see you, it'd be amazing. <laughs> well, Osuna, thank you so much. I know you got to run and get thank ready you. for the show. We can't wait to see what you're going to do. Welcome back to the VMAs. Thank you. Thank you for your time. VMAs. Of course. <laughs> now, there's so much more VMA pre-show left, including performances by Kim Petras and Swedish House Mafia. Appearances from your favorite stars and so much more. You're not going to want to miss it, all right? Hang tight. Two of the biggest names in music, Ariana Grande and Little Nas X, are nominated for a combined eight awards tonight. Let's just take a look at their journeys to the VMA. The biggest names in the business are here tonight, including one of the new faces of pop, Ariana Grande. How excited are you about this? I'm very excited. I'm very nervous, too, but I'm very excited. What's up, Brooklyn? Oh, I want to thank my fans who I love so, so much. I love them more than anything. And I want to thank MTV for supporting me and my music. Thank you so, 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 so much. Woo! Charlamagne here with Ariana Grande. Tonight you're nominated for five VMAs, including Best Female Video, Best Pop Video, and Best Collaboration. How does it feel? I'm very excited. I'm very honored to be nominated. It's awesome. You won't get away so much. Say I should get First of all, to my fans, I love you guys so much.
him by his name. Little Nas M. Over the last few years, Lil Nas X has made his mark on the VMAs. With his VMA debut, performing his brand new single, Panini. Hey, Panini, don't you be a meanie. He's performed. And the VMA goes to Lil Nas X is in He's won. This is my first award ever, and I, I, got, a, I got a little speech, so, you know. And tonight, with six nominations, let's see if Lil Nas X can do it again. Show. Now I am joined by, oh, I don't even want to tell you. I am joined by the girl from Rio herself, Miss Anita. Hi, how are you? It is so great to see you here. Thanks. Thank you so much. On a scale of one to ten, how excited are you? Yeah, I'm so happy. It's my first time here. What was it's, that like? It is your first time. It's crazy. It's the first time of a Brazilian person here. <laughs> at all so i'm actually so happy i feel so honored listen you should be proud of yourself you are representing yourself and your culture and i know about your fandom but tell us a little bit about the energy from your fans well, watching back home they are very intense i would say that they are crazy we've been like talking before <laughs> you see that they mm -hmm. go intense they answer everyone, they send questions, they are yes. crazy in a good way. They support you and that's why you're here tonight. Now For listen, sure. you are representing Brazil to the fullest and you're performing later on tonight in the show. I cannot wait for that. Uh, but you even teamed up with Burger King as a part of their Keep It Real Meals campaign. But what can you tease, okay? And tell us a little bit about tonight's performance. It's gonna be a very, uh, Royalty. I'm ha I'm gonna have my two moments, the two personas, my real one, which is Larissa, the yeah. one I'm like in my house, you know, and the Anita one, it's the diva singer, all this fancy, glamorous style. So people are gonna see Anita and the real me. Listen, Keep it real. And speaking of real you, because you look all real tonight. I wanted to ask you about that, okay? Because when you hit the stage, that's okay. right, she's Anita. Yeah. But when you're at home chilling, you are Larissa. So yeah. I wanted to know, who are we really going to get tonight? And are we going to be able to tell the difference? I think you guys are going to get a little bit of both. In the beginning, a little bit of Larissa for you guys to just say hi very quick. And then we go full diva moment. Ooh, well, <laughs> listen, we live for alter ego tonight. <laughs> I mean, yes. I and then we can just keep going to the end of the night. Party, oh. after party, oh. getting drunk, okay. having fun, okay. that's it. Listen, show us how you do it in Brazil. Best of luck of you tonight. Enjoy Thank this you. moment. And congratulations, Thank Anita. Uh oh, I mean Larissa. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see who else is on the red carpet. Wow, wow. Can we just take a moment? Have mercy. What is happening, Chloe and Haley? How are you? We are so great. So happy to be here together and like kicking ass and it's going to be a great night. Now, Chloe, this is going to be, you know, your solo main stage debut. Hallie, what are you going to be doing in the meantime when she's up on that stage? I'm going to be screaming my head <laughs> off, okay? Um, I'm so excited. This has just been such a wonderful 
time watching her rehearse. Nobody is ready for this performance is all I have to say. Wait a minute. You. you can't just say that and not give us some insight. What are, tell us something. The visuals. Are we going to see some of what we saw in the Have Mercy video on that stage? Yes, definitely. I'm bringing the music video to life, and I'm so happy to perform, and I'm going to feel comfortable on that stage because my beautiful sister is going to be presenting me. So I'm more than excited and grateful. I've just been over the moon, excited and happy with the response to Have Mercy. I'm so grateful, and we get to be here together, and it's going to be really special. Is it going to be kind of weird not to see her right next to you on that stage? It is, but I will because I'm going to look right up, and she's going to be right there in her beautiful gown, and I'm going to be like, okay, I feel better. I can do this because she's right there. You got there. this. She's yes. all under control yes. right now. Yes. Well, how do you both prepare for a night like this? Do you give each other pep talks? How does this work? Pray. 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 It's really yeah. prayer. And then, yeah, that's it. Lots of notes. I like, I... <laughs> Listen. <laughs> you hear that? <laughs> Chloe and Hallie is the chant right now. Look at your fans. Look at this. Hi, what a guys. moment. Oh, oh my God. Just cry now. I can't cry. Wait, we can't cry. The makeup's no, too gorgeous no, right no. now. But you know what? To see you on this journey, yeah. and I've seen you for years now, yeah. I am so proud of the both of you. And to see the support system right That's now. That's my best friend right here. Yeah. Well, tell me the inspiration behind the outfits. I can't let you guys yes. run off without telling me something. Well, I was definitely inspired by, like, the Medusa mm. witchy vibe for the video, and I'm wearing Marnie, and it's so fun and comfortable. So and cute. Sis, what are you wearing, darling? And I am wearing Monat, <laughs> and it is just comfortable, and that's all I needed. <laughs> and yes, very comfortable, and it's just like, wow, it's all well put together. Well, what's your must have when you hit the red carpet? Each other. Each other. And um. a piece of gum so our breath doesn't <laughs> sink. Yeah. And some perfume yeah. so I'm not I forgot up. the gum, so I hope yeah. it's all right I, I over got, here. I got the gum for you guys. Don't even <laughs> worry. Well, thank you to the both of you. Thank you. Look amazing. Best of luck on that stage. Thank Can't wait you. to see you. Can't wait to hear you so scream for your sister. It's going to be amazing. <laughs> There's still so much more pre-show to come. What else is happening on the red carpet? Our next performer is here to sing Future Is Now from her upcoming album. But before Kim Petras performs, let's see how this trailblazing icon got ready for her BMA show per VMA show debut. What's up, MTV? I'm Kim Petrus. I'm at rehearsals for the VMAs. So the inspiration for this performance came from, it happened after Lollapalooza in Chicago. I always feel like going on stage and performing really frees my brain up. And I woke up the next morning and I was like, I have the idea. And uh, I mean, a little tease would be that it's sticky and uh, it's pure pop. It's bubblegum pop, you could say. I came up with this idea uh, with my amazing team. We made it happen, and it was amazing today to see it, uh, like my kind of vision of it, I guess, uh, for the first time, and it's I'm really proud of it. Of course, I can't do the VMAs without a little change. I can't just give you one look, so stay tuned for the end of the performance. But I am so happy with it. I just tried it on for the first time, and it, it, it hits, slaps. All right, MTV, that's all I can show you, or I'll give it all away. Love you. Ah. And now this bubblegum pop princess is ready to rock out. Give it up for Kim Petras. It's so good to see you guys. Choose. 
Best direction. Calling my phone like I'm locked up, non-stop. From the plane to the helicopter, yo. Champagne and drinking with your friends. You live in the dark, boy, I cannot pretend. The more that you say, the less I know. Wherever you stray, I follow. Yeah, in my white tee. Yeah, call the white Williams for the hype, please. Two, four, five hundred stacks for the hood. Call me Lumberjack, cause I wish you never would. Best cinematography. Brown skin girl, your skin just like pearls. I'm not your friend. direction time already time already time already time already do my bad habits lead to i hate i stay in space this is biological stasis my mood shifting to manic places romantic 
Talking, you don't even have to try. You're cute enough to f with me tonight. That's my best friend. She a real bad driver on car. She don't need no lift. Begging for you to take my hand. Make my plans. That's my man. That's visual effects. The same build a bell. You don't get to pick and choose. That's choreography. That's editing. You can call me Midas This is what it's like when you're on my list Shoot, don't miss Love it how it feels when we're just vibing Don't fight it Canceled all my pens, all the sidekicks <laughs> So much happening right now. Welcome back. And I'm fangirling a little bit right now because I'm joined by the iconic pop star, rocker, trendsetter, VMA vet, Avril Lavigne. Hi, Avril. Hi, how are you? Great. Welcome back to the VMAs. Thank you. It's great to be here. I know. Now, I know you've had memorable moments at the VMAs. Do you have an all-time favorite memory? Um, well, the VMAs hold a very special place in my heart because oh. this is where I won my very first award ever, a Moon Man <laughs> for Best New Artist. So oh. I love to be at the VMAs. Do you have any advice for an upcoming artist right now after sharing that story? Um, my advice is always just be like true to yourself and follow your heart and have as much fun as possible That's and just right. yeah be true to yourself do your thing and one of the best parts of the VMAs is the fans absolutely <laughs> <laughs> now how's everybody feeling tonight everyone is so excited tonight I know but they're outside and I feel like the best part of everything is oh, happening wait. on the inside so no I think way. We should fix this. Do you if guys that's have okay? tickets to the shows, to the VMAs? No? Oh no, no, can no, no. We do something I about think we that? can actually. Thanks to Geico and MTV, it's gonna happen. Everybody's getting tickets. Oh my god! You're gonna be inside the 2021 VMAs. Oh, that's so amazing! <laughs> yeah. I love this. Avril, isn't this beautiful? That this awesome. joy, that excitement. <laughs> yeah. It's amazing. Well, listen, Avril, have an amazing time inside. Thank you. you all are so amazing. Have fun, okay? Have fun at the show. <laughs> now let's go ahead and check out what's happening on the red carpet. <laughs> so silly. Oh, beautiful. So silly. Mm, come on. I am standing right here with three pop music icons. I'm talking about Lance Bass, AJ McLean, and Nick Lachey. Thank you. What up? Oh, my goodness. Guys. Now I can't. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's that. oh, our yeah. family over there. There we go. Now, I can't lie, gentlemen. This is every 90s girl's dream right here, OK? And I just have to say that you are representing three of the greatest boy bands of all wow. time. Thank you. Thank you got to put you. respect on the name, okay? Now, I know what it means for fans to see you guys here, to get the love. You heard them chanting the songs. But I got to ask you guys, as the OGs, the icons, <laughs> what is it like gracing the red carpet once again? It's awesome. I mean, this is, you know, this is a part of history for all three groups. I mean, we've been doing this for almost 30 years now. And to still be able to come here, MTV VMAs, 
and get that kind of love and respect is phenomenal. So they've actually asked us to be the chaperones tonight. <laughs> yeah, so uh, <laughs> that yeah. <laughs> to enforce the six foot rule. Yep. 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 Yeah, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, back, 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 <laughs> back, back, back. Choice of what are you doing? Really quick, okay, because it's rare that we get a chance to talk to living icons that are still as relevant as you guys. What is your favorite VMA moment? Really quick. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. Um, Years ago, we were presenting an award and, and one of the guys from Rage like climbed the set and like literally shut down the award show live. It was, yeah. I love it. You guys are doing some amazing things still. Nick, I just got to talk about it because you have a very special event coming up early next year yeah. and it's called Total Relief Live. Yeah, Tell us TRL, a little bit about that. Total Relief Live. Okay. Putting together a fundraising concert obviously along with MTV. Uh, TRL era acts coming together for a fundraising night benefiting Feeding America. It's going to happen in January uh, in Los Angeles of 2022. So excited to uh, to put that on. And obviously, if you're going to call something TRL, you got to go to the marquee names of TRL. Right so here. So my boys are here representing yeah, tonight, yes. and we're excited to put this together and excited to uh, to bring it to the world. I love it. Well, we're all support, and I just got to say, Nick, AJ, Lance, thank you for your time. Enjoy <laughs> thank tonight. You. Thank you. Now, so what's going on on the red carpet? Because you know what's happening over here. Well, I'm now joined by the incredible global pop star, Troy Savant. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. Global pop star, that's nice. You like nice. that? Yeah, that was okay. very nice. Well, let's go back a little bit. I saw you on the red carpet in 2016, so I know the Crazy. VMAs holds a special place in your heart. Very, very special. I remember that day so clearly, and um, yeah, it was like a highlight for me. I really, I loved it. it yeah? Great. How yeah. does it feel to be back tonight? I'm so stoked. Yeah? I'm so stoked. I've already seen some crazy shit. <laughs> Um, and I am, yeah, I'm looking forward to the rest of the night. I think it's going to be good. Oh, yeah, it's going to be beautiful. Now, you've already been getting ready for the VMAs before you even got here. Yeah. You had your special performance, pushed to the VMAs concert, which was yeah. amazing. Thanks to Extra Gum for making that happen. So tell me, how was it to be reunited with your fans again? Well, that was the thing. It was my first time performing live in, like, over two years. And, um... Yeah, I don't know. I just was like, I got nervous. It was like my first show all over again, but it was it was amazing. It was a really good time. Yeah? yeah. Well, guess what? We are going to see some of that performance later on during that show. Ooh. That's okay, right? Yeah, of course. That's going to be coming up. I really appreciate you stopping by, Troy. Thanks so much for having me. We'll see you in a little bit. I love the outfit. Thank you. Thank I wish you. I could pull it together, but here I am trying my best. No, you look amazing. What I'm are you trying. talking about? Hey, listen, I'm just trying to be on your level right now. No, you're doing it. You're doing thank it. Thank you. Thank yeah. you so much. Now let's see what else is happening on the red carpet right now. Yes, I just have to tell you guys how excited we are uh, about tonight. We have so much coming up. There is so much in store. And I just have to say that there are so many awards to be won tonight. You guys can hear them. They are getting excited. We have Polo G right there behind us. And I just have to tell you that, I mean, tonight is on fire. Um, but, I, but I have to switch to a more... Uh, inclusive topic, okay? We got to talk about something that's very, very important because the artists nominated tonight for video for good category, I mean, they really took their messages beyond the music and they wowed us with their powerful and inspirational videos this year. Now, these artists address topics like oppression, addiction, division, trauma, and abuse, and they even showed us that no topic is taboo. Plus, we're all in this together. Now, one topic that is very important to us all is mental health, because mental health is health. So I want you guys to take care of yourself and the people around you. If you're struggling, just know there's help. Go to mentalhealthishealth.us to learn more. Now, let's see what else is going on on the red carpet. Foo Fighters, Blackpink, BTS, after the break, 25 million of you guys voted for our Group of the Year Award. After the break, we'll be announcing the winner. But first, the moon person has wrecked MTV since its inception in 1981 because we've always been inspired by the exploration of new worlds and the idea that anything is possible. So what better way to celebrate tonight than with some real-life moon people? Take a look. Hello, I'm NASA astronaut Megan MacArthur of the Expedition 65 crew aboard the International Space Station, here with my crewmate Shane Kimbrough. We are orbiting the Earth 260 miles above all of you. And like everyone tonight at the VMAs, we have an excellent view of the stars, just different kinds of stars. Part of our work here is to advance science and technology so we can launch our Artemis missions, which will include sending the first woman and first person of color to the moon. We want to congratulate MTV on its 40th anniversary and for recognizing that the sky's not the limit. From your launch in 1981 with Apollo mission footage 
to today with the Moon Person Award and its message of diversity. We at NASA share the vision of inclusion to reach the moon and beyond. Have a great night. There's so much awesome talent that walked down the carpet tonight. I mean, I'm standing next to one right now, MGK. And while we know it's always been an honor to be nominated winning a VMA, it's also a whole mood when someone walks away with a moon person. Now, here are some of past winners that really had their own moment with their moon person. Winning a video music award can get pretty emotional for not only the winner, but for all of us watching at home. Here are some of the artists who had us in our feels. I want to share this award with everybody. Just because we're separated right now and culture may feel less alive in some ways, I know a renaissance is coming. This is what I believe. I want nothing more than to be your artist in 2020. And the winner, Miley Cyrus! My name is Jesse, and I am accepting this award on behalf of the 1.6 million runaways and homeless youth in the United States. I know this because I'm one of these people. Recently, I was driving my daughter to school, and she said to me, out of the blue, Mama, I'm the ugliest girl I know. And I said, you know, I really want to know why you feel this way about yourself. And she said, well, I look like a boy. And I said, well, what do you think I look like? I said to her, I said, do you see me growing my hair? She said, no, Mama. I said, do you see me changing the way I present myself to the world? No, Mama. Do you see me selling out arenas all over the world? Yes, Mama. You know, the video is, is about, you know, being being me, being black and Jewish. I went to this house party one time, and uh, when I showed up there, you know, it was a bunch of kids. I ended up, like, getting made fun of. But the point is, I want to dedicate this award to, like, any kid that's ever had a long walk home by yourself. This is to you, man, for real. We made it, bitch. There you go. Kick out that way. Show us the front of the dress, shall we? Do your shit, sir. There we go. Oh, wow. Yes, welcome back, and yes, look who I ran into. It is happening, VMA winning the Blonde Dawn Machine Gun Kelly. Hi, hi. We are reunited. It's we been are a reunited. while. Many years. And yes, I'm so many happy years. Because you've Thank been you. supportive of mine for a very long time. A very long time. I am yeah. so proud of you. Last year we saw you perform during the pre-show. This year, main stage. Thanks to Doritos, this is gonna be incredible. How do you feel about this? Uh, I mean, one, I always wanted to rock, walk a red carpet with fans and, and, and be yes. able to see people and like the stuff that I watched on MTV when I was That's growing right. up. That's right. I think like 
manifestation is the key word for me. I, I, mm. I, I tweeted nine years ago that I wanted to perform at the VMAs. Obviously, it's been like a lifetime dream for me. So the fact that it came true, it, it's I'm glad that's happening now yes. than earlier. And it made me like earn my right to be here. You know? Yeah. Remember growing up in Cleveland in this moment, did you think it was going to happen? Talk to me. Oh, yeah. Ask anybody in Cleveland. They'll tell you. <laughs> I was walking around with mixtapes telling everybody like, dude, yeah. I'm the hottest thing going here. Like, <laughs> you'll know. And <laughs> now, we're getting ready for your performance tonight. You always take it to another level. How are you going to do that tonight? Um, I've been really inspired by almost like musical theater, if that, yes. if, if that makes any sense. I, it oh, will yeah. when you see it. But um, kind of like an interpretation of the lyrics that I wrote in my brain, and then you take it and make what you want of it. I'm so excited. And I saw you and your lady, Megan, walking down this red carpet. Yes, yes, Wait, we can't just, you know, talk through everything and not talk about how amazing the both of you looked. What? Thank you. Yeah, that's all her, but. Is she deciding what you're wearing? Are you helping her? What's that like? What's that conversation in the room like, MGK? Come on. It's 50-50. It's like, uh, this one she took the lead. I like it. And I get the pleasure of having her on my arm all night. and. Oh She's my beautiful. gosh. Yeah, she is. She's back there in case the cameras can't see. Well, listen, MGK, have an amazing time tonight. Say hi to your lady. I will. Love seeing you as always. Hey, and I know you. there's more stuff happening on the red carpet right now. What's going on? Welcome back. It's time to give a very special VMA. And I'm here with one of the trailblazing digital, digital creators on social media to tell you more about it, Brett Monroe. Woo! Thank you for having me. I'm so happy to be here. You know me, Tanache. Oh, yeah. I'm always ready to serve. Oh, my gosh. And you're serving in this vintage gown looking. Yes. Oh. Mr. Roberto Cavalli, shout out to you. Chef's kiss. This week, MTV has been celebrating the creators, artists, and songs that blew up on TikTok. And honey, there is a lot of them. And so many performing artists tonight have inspired huge trends. Do you think Lil Nas has seen the industry baby TikTok? The one that you did, honey, everyone has seen it. He better have seen it. I think he has. <laughs> Fans voted on TikTok last week for categories like Best New Artist and Creator Collab and Best Comeback Song. All but one of the winners were announced on Friday during the live stream celebration. And so right here, right now, we're going to reveal the trendiest VMA winner for Breakthrough Best, best Breakthrough Song. Let's take a look at the nominees. <laughs> And the winner is Claire Rosencrantz. Woo! Unfortunately, she couldn't make it here tonight, so I will be accepting her award on her behalf. Well, congratulations. I know I said this before, but this is my favorite, favorite time to give out another award. And next up, it's for Group of the Year. You guys love the 21, 2021 nominees. BTS, Foo Fighters, CNCO, Jonas Brothers, Maroon 5, Silk Sonic, and Blackpink. Well, you voted an incredible 25 million times. Which what? is insane. That's an that's like an insane amount of votes. Yes. If all of those votes followed me on Instagram, <laughs> I don't know. May I don't know. Follow me. <laughs> and the winner is BTS. Woo! Congratulations to BTS. They couldn't be here either tonight, but they wanted to send their love and a special thank you to all of their fans. Let's take a look. Here we are, BTS. Thank you, VMAs, for the Group of the Year Award. And I mean, it's all possible thanks to you guys, or we can't meet in person. Feel your love every minute and second. We love you and we miss you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. Thank you. Look who I found. Okay, <laughs> Simone Biles here. By the way, I've been stretching. I've been trying to get right. <laughs> but listen, I can't even do a cartwheel. Yeah. I can't do anything you do. You're incredible. Thank you. Thank you so much for taking the time to be here today. You're what an event, the VMAs, right? I'm very excited. Now, I heard you're going to be on stage. Mm -hmm. 
what are you going to be you know, doing on that stage? Because yes. I'm so curious now. So I'll be presenting Doja Cat tonight. Wait a minute. <laughs> you said it so casually. Yeah. That's going to be amazing. Yeah. This is exciting. Any pressure? I honestly feel more nervous than I do competing, and I don't know why, what? but I don't know. What is it? It's like a little bit out of my element. Okay, a little bit, but you're yeah. doing amazing. Thank you. Okay, so what is your must-go-to item that you have to have when you hit the red carpet? Ooh, probably lip gloss. Keep lip them gloss. fresh. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Can't go wrong with that. No, <laughs> not at all. Well, yes. out of all the nominees tonight, who's on your playlist when you're getting ready to work out? Okay, definitely right now, my hype list. I'm super excited to pronounce to announce her, but it's also Doja Cat. Really? You're not yes. just saying that? No, I'm not just saying that. I'm dead serious. <laughs> We're like jamming to her. Love that is her music. so awesome. Yes. Well, listen, would you be able to teach me a couple moves, or do you think it's like I've had my run? Okay. Maybe afterwards. Maybe after. Yeah. Okay, wow. You're so nice. <laughs> I love you. it. Well, Simone Biles, I can't wait to see you on that stage. Congratulations on all of your success. We all love you so much. Thank you so much. Of course. It's going to be amazing. And, of course, we still have so much more coming up. We'll be right back with more of the 2021 VMAs pre-show after this. Now, we all know that the artists nominated tonight are going to show up, <laughs> but we have no idea how they're going to arrive or what they're going to do once they're inside. How about we take a quick look at just how unpredictable the MTV VMAs can be. The celebrities who show up to the VMAs don't just make entrances, they reinvent them. From yachts to fire trucks to circus animals. The VMA red carpet arrivals have and will always be absolutely legendary. Let's take a look at some of our favorites. No one has ever made an entrance quite like this ever. Please welcome to the VMA white carpet, the boys of 30 seconds to Mars. This is typical uh, Who's your bike favorite? riding chaos right, right bike now. Riding. Wow. wow. You look down Dean Street in Brooklyn, here comes Pharrell on the red carpet riding on a bike and a crew of bicyclers doing bike tricks what a red carpet interest this is man pharrell williams give it up for pharrell brooklyn and right, right now to radio city music hall it's pink uh, did they let you play with the siren we got the siren how's my hair it, it's it's wind sweat and i saw this cat coming in from long beach california he's driving up right now up the ramp give it up for so snoop dogg how y'all like his car We've had a fire truck tonight, but now we've got a party bus with, of course, Cobra Starship. And how much grander can you get than this? Oh my gosh, the circus has arrived, ladies and gentlemen. I give you the ringmaster, T-Pain. How you doing, man? What's going on, man? What a beautiful ride. Well, I'm trying to do what I can, you know? Yes, indeed. A man with a tan, Ricky Martin. Let's see how long it takes you to disembark from this ride. The VMAs are known for the awards, fashion, and killer performances. But if you think you know what's going to happen, think again. Let's check out some of the most unpredictable moments from the VMA stage. Oh my God! Oh! Wow, I'm so happy to be back on planet Earth. You guys look so great! Who's 
This is a, a huge surprise to be one of the world's most hated rock bands to be getting an award right now. Thanks to that guy right there. This guy is rock and roll. He should be getting the award. I want to thank you guys so much. I can't hear anything I'm saying. Let me hold it. Shout out to Kevin and Tiff. And Tiff, don't be coming for Fifth Harmony because Normani is that bitch. <laughs> Welcome back to the 2021 MTV VMA Red Carpet, coming to you live from the Barclays Center in Brooklyn, New York. Earlier, Nessa got a chance to talk to one of the night's most anticipated performers, the iconic Ed Sheeran. Let's see what he had to say. I am here with the incredibly talented, amazing artist. I've been waiting such a long time to have this conversation with you, Ed Sheeran. Thank you, that's so such sweet. Such a pleasure, you're so talented. Thank you. And we're in Brooklyn, look how beautiful this, this is This right is now. wonderful, it is wonderful to be back. Well, how does it feel for you to be back right here at the VMAs? It feels good, yeah, it feels good. I think my first one was in like 2013 and that was actually in New York, that was at Barclays as well. And I've always loved it, it's always nice. It's so like different to UK award shows. It's a bit more free, fun, like, yes. yeah. At every VMA show, incredible moments happen. We don't know what to expect, but what are you looking forward to? I think it'd be good for a controversial moment to happen. In the past few VMAs, it's all been quite sort of like safe and nice. Right. I think it's quite nice when something out of the ordinary happens. Now you're nominated yeah. for different categories. Congratulations, Thank including you. video of the year for Bad Habits. Thank you. How did you react when you found out about all of these nominations? I obviously feel really honored, but then you look in the category and you go, yeah, I'm not winning that. <laughs> listen, lots of superstars. No, it, but yeah, listen, yeah. come on. So today you're going to do a special performance for, you know, all the fans, which is really exciting. Yeah. You're going to be performing from the Toyota stage, and I don't want you to spill everything you're going to do, but what can we expect? Give us some inside scoop. Well, I might as well spill what I'm going to do. Yeah, I'm do, playing, it, do I'm it. playing my new single, which came out Friday. Shivers. So, yeah. Shivers, yeah, shivers. I'm doing I'm doing some other stuff with the band um, this week, but it's good fun. Ed Sheeran, it was such a pleasure to be having this conversation you with you me. today. I know you got to get ready. Yeah, it's yeah. going to be amazing. Brooklyn, get ready for the whole world. Get ready for the VMAs. Let's see what else is happening on the red carpet with my co-hosts. We're having an amazing time, and it's about to get even better because our next performers are ready to take this party to the next level. After an eight-year hiatus, they're back with their album, Paradise Again. It'll be dropping later this year. Peter Perform, It Gets Better, and Lifetime, Let's Get Loud for Swedish House Mafia!
a lifetime. Baby, it's the right time. I put on a red light. Told you it was on no side. You had on that sundress. Never felt an impress. We had the best sex. We made love all night. One of the best-selling musical artists of all time makes their return to the VMAs tonight after six whole years. And baby, 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 oh, we are thrilled. It's Justin Bieber. The Biebs has had so many iconic trips to the VMA stage, and we thought we'd take a look back at his storied VMA history. I got my peaches out in Georgia. I get my Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber, what up, bro? Nice to meet you, dude. You're a popular young man. You're 15. Thank you. You're at the VMAs. The girls are going crazy. Life is pretty good, right? Yeah. The winner is Justin Bieber. Thank you so much, everybody. This means a lot to me. You know, thank you to everybody here. Thank you so much. What do you mean? TV's always supported me, so mm -hmm. for me to come out and support them and, and just show love, and it's always been so um, mutual, so I just love, I love the VMAs. Yeah. Pretty awesome. This is going to be a performance we're going to be talking about for a long time. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. I just kind of want to take my own path. I, I think that, I think I'll do pretty well. Put him on his knees, give him something to believe in. Never lost a fight, but I'm looking for a okay. in the food chain. I'm the one that if he not, he's a bottom feeder. Stand for big demeanor. I can make you before I ever meet you. If it don't hang, then it can't. You can't hurt my feelings, but I like pain. If it, me as who's easy when I rock again, I'm gonna spell my name. Welcome back. I'm here with the absolutely iconic and legendary Alicia Keys. Alicia, you have brought a 
it to the carpet tonight. We are so happy that you're here with us right now. You're returning to the VMA stage tonight to sing your new single. What can viewers expect? Oh man, tonight is gonna be so crazy. First of all, the energy is outrageous. Y'all see what's going on already. It is nuts. La La, you're gonna hear it for the first time on the VMA stage, myself and Sway Lee. And we also got to tribute my great city, New York City. So we're gonna have the elegance, the opulence, the vibe, the energy, and the love always. Amazing, amazing. Well, thank you so much for being here with us. I love you personally. You're one you of my back. icons. So thank you, thank you for being here. Thanks for talking to us, Alicia. Nessa, what's good? Well, listen, it's been an incredible night already, and the big show hasn't even started. Listen to this. I'm so happy to be here. Thank you to everyone who was a part of the pre-show tonight, the musicians, the performers, all of the fans right here, and my amazing co-hosts, Jamila and Tinashe. Now listen, we've seen some incredible moments on the red carpet. You can relive it all. It is happening here, minutes away. I can't wait for this. Tinashe, I'm so curious, what were some of the outfits that stood out to you? Because I can let you know from now, oh my gosh, MGK, Megan Fox, they were amazing. Yes, there were some pretty amazing icons, iconic outfits tonight. My favorite was Lil Nas X. I mean, yes. how could you forget that purple <laughs> number, showstopper. But I also like Jack Harlow in the green. You know, there was a lot of good, the men showed out tonight, I thought. Oh, for sure. Doja Cat looked amazing. Now, Tinashe, I don't know if you had a chance to see it when I was talking to her. Her fans were chanting her name out here. I mean, it was so wild. How the about energy. for you? Who was out there that the fans were losing it for? I think the energy here is insane tonight. Everyone's so happy to be here. Got it. It's well, so listen, incredible. It's we got to wrap it up. It's so much fun. Here we go. Enjoy the show, everyone. The 2021 Video Music Enjoy Awards starts now. Enjoy the show, now. everyone. The 2021 Video Music Awards.